So here's a quick overview of how SmartSuite fits into the competitive landscape in the productivity software space. So today on the market, there's really two categories of products. There's products like Airtable that are positioned as a no-code database, and they're great at managing a relational no-code database, but it becomes very challenging to manage task slash project management in there because they don't have features like time tracking, checklists, sub items, or a my work section that rolls up all the user's tasks into one place. Then you have tools like ClickUp, Asana, Trello, Monday, so on and so forth that are great at project management, but it becomes very challenging to manage a relational no-code database in there. And uh, for example, when you're assigned to something in ClickUp, everything shows up in your homepage, but many things are not action items, so it just clogs up your homepage. Where SmartSuite is playing is a new category called work management, where it enables you to do both a no-code relational database, as you can tell over here, and we actually did that even better than Airtable, since you can actually not only link records within the same uh, base or solution, as we call it in SmartSuite, but you can actually link records across the entire workspace. And we have a lot more settings, so filters and view types and so on and so display format, so on and so forth. So a better no-code database, a relational database, um, very easy to manage, as you can tell, gorgeous UI, so on and so forth. But then it becomes also very easy to manage task slash project management since we have time tracking and checklists and sub items with their own custom statuses and field types and the my work section that will roll up all of a user's tasks from across the entire platform. Now, note that we actually solve this in a better way than ClickUp or the traditional task slash project management. So how do we set apart and know if this is actually a to-do item that should go in the my work section or maybe this is just a data point, part of my relational no-code database. Well, the answer to that is when you set up the assigned to field type, you get to decide, is this an action item or not? Should this show up in the my work section up top over here or not? And the way you control that is by linking the my work section to a stat, the, sorry, you link the assigned to field type to the status. And so if the assigned to field type is linked to a status, we know this is an action item. We know we're going to save this for a second. We know that the status, we know what's marked as complete. So we know if this is still an open item or not. And then we can show it for the, we can roll up all the users' tasks into the My Work section and they can just dive right in and start working on whatever's assigned to them. Now, if it's not linked, if the assigned to field type is not linked to a status field type, then we know it's just a data point, part of my no-code relational database, and then it does not show up into the My Work section. And so this way, SmartSuite is solving both the ability to have a relational database, a no-code relational database, that won't clog up your My Work section because we know what's a to-do item and what's just a data point in your database. But it's also very easy to create task slash project management systems in here because we have checklists, sub items, time tracking, the My Work section, and many more features.